is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good morning, everyone. On the second day of November, it is Wednesday, and we're looking at uh, Wednesday, the 2nd of November. Yep. And we're down 150 in the Dow, 32,506. The reason why we got a little cautious uh, for subscribers to my opening call over the last two days is we were expecting that obligation of a peak D in the Chapman Wave methodology. If there's no new high above yesterday's high today, we'll see what the Fed does. This will be a peak D. This is about where you'd expect some kind of consolidation. The technicals are still very strong. It would take a move down to the 32,000. Uh, 300, 200 area to really say, uh-oh, now you're going to restart a new buy signal or you're going to be consolidating for a lot longer. We're looking at this is the Dow we're talking about. The S&P is down 17. At 38, 38, this is probably a peak E. So all of these things are saying to me, a little consolidation going, no matter what the Fed says, there should be some kind of consolidation going on here. Spectacular move, one of the quickest 4,000 plus moves we've had in the Dow, straight up going to a leg D that I, I've, I can recall. Uh, we're looking at the QQQ is kind of weak today, down 77 cents at 274. IWM, the Russell 2000, <clears throat> making a peak D today, probably. Very nice move from 162 to the 186 area, now at 181, down to gold. Gold is up $6 at 16.55, <clears throat> still stuck in this containment area. Looking at the dollar, actually pulling back some, down 36 ticks at 111.20. Uh, also just stuck in its range, now crude oil. Crude oil is uh, pulling back just a hair down 30 cents at 88.07. Stuck in this Chapman Wave inside track repellent zone. Does it become a propellant zone if it gets to the 91, 92 area? Yes, it does. So we're watching this very closely. The TLT, that's bonds, uh, a little bit uh, stronger today, up 6 cents at 96.83. <clears throat> Yields, we're going to be watching those yields after the Fed speak today at 2 to 2.30 this afternoon. Eastern time, we'll be watching it closely. Basil Chapman, Tiger Technicians Hour coming up in a few minutes. Check out my opening call daily newsletter and uh, great programming here at TFNN all day. You'll see exactly what happens after, what, uh, after the Fed speak because it's kind of an important, we kind of know it's uh, 75, uh, raising 75, but what happens after that? So as I'm waiting for the uh, music to come on, there it is. I didn't beat the bell. <laughs> Good. We'll be back in a few minutes. Hope you can stay, Basil Chapman.